Hello there. It's Charlie Veach here again. Charlie Che Guevara Veach. How are you? Yes, I'm uh, welcome to my back garden here in West London. Um, luckily, uh, there are no helicopters around at the moment. Um, there is a helicopter pad nearby, but um, there's nothing flying from it for the moment, so it, it doesn't sound like Vietnam here. Mm. Well, maybe it does sound a bit like Vietnam, but it's a, a very quiet pipe. It's a very quiet part of Vietnam, you know. Um, maybe it's a place in Vietnam where there are no helicopter pads. Mm. Anyway, anyway, uh, I just come here to tell you that um, conspiracy theorists are the enemy of the resistance. Yes, they are. That's right, because they couldn't give a fuck. A fuck. They couldn't give a fuck. This is the problem, you see, because conspiracy theorists, you conspiracy theorists, are distracting people from real progressive activism about things that matter. You know, like, um, how about the fact that uh, one in three women experience rape? as their first sexual contact, and uh, poverty in Africa, and the war on terror, and the invasion of Libya. You see, the thing is, if you believe that 9-11 was an inside job, or you believe that um, the moon landings never happened, or that Kennedy was assassinated, it is proof that you don't care about those things I just mentioned. That's right. To care about the invasion of, Af the invasion of Libya, to care about people dying of poverty in Africa, you have to believe the official story of all those conspiracy theorists. Theories. Yes, you do. That's right, Ian. It's very disrespectful, you know, to the victims of 9-11 when you, you say things like 9-11 was an inside job. You know, I met Mark Bigham's mother and, um, you know, she, she, she it really is horrible. And um, I learned a lot from meeting Mark Bingham, Bingham's mother, you know. In fact, um, yesterday I saw an old lady getting beaten up in the street. And she was left dying in the gutter by these thugs. I was about to call the police, but then I realised that if I do that, I'm showing her disrespect. Hmm. You know, it's, it's true, you know. I mean, you can take it from me, because um, I am an anarcho-primitivist, a crypto-syndicalist, quasi-Marxist, pseudo-Trotskyist. That's right, I am. And now then, I've got to uh, nip off in a moment and find uh, some pretty girls to interview, you know, like Charlotte from the... Conspiracy Theory Road Trip, and um, that girl Karin from a Mission Impossible. Um, so uh, I better go and get them. And if there's any other pretty girls who like a sort of um, be interviewed by a, a finely chiselled jawline male stubble hunk like me, who was going to go to Sanders but didn't, but is still a kind of military type guy, um, you know, who's very erudite and sophisticated, and all those other wonderful things that I am, then um, please let me know. Hmm. Right, uh, I think, how long is this video now? Three minutes, my goodness me. My stubble's coming up again. Time for another shave, I think.